very happy that I can participate in this occasion and uh, kicking off uh, this uh, cooperation. I think um, there are several reasons why we should be happy that we got funding and that we uh, uh, got together uh, on, on, to do this project together. One thing is, of course, with the current political situation, um, it is uh, extremely important to maintain academic corporations um, disregarding uh, political conflicts. Uh, we all know how difficult it has become to uh, conduct these international operations um, in, in this what's been happening. Um, many other kinds of become harder on the political, but for us scientists to maintain these bridges and work together. You all know also how much uh, COVID-19 has um, hampered us in our um, efforts to work together. Um, we would all, uh, I'm sure, uh, prefer to sit together in person today, regardless whether in Rurke or in Potsdam. Uh, now, now we have Zoom, which is uh, better than nothing, but of course, uh, it's not the same thing. But still, uh, I think it is important for us academic institutions to work together. And that's why I'm glad to uh, see so many of you being so um, enthusiastic about this cooperation. All right, so another reason why I think um, this is a wonderful project is of course the topic you're working on. Um, you know, of course, that uh, sustainability, environmental protection, climate change are topics that um, are very important for us here at the University of Potsdam. Uh, and as I learned, uh, there are also topics that are very important for you at Rurke. So um, uh, I'm happy that we got one additional um, piece of the puzzle with this project uh, that complements our many, many activities in this uh, important uh, topical space. Um, you are working on predicting natural hazards. Um, don't have to tell you um, how relevant that is uh, these days um, worldwide, not only for areas that have for a long time been affected by climate change, but um, even here in Germany, of course, this is something that we feel and uh, uh, where uh, the techniques that you are have been developing and that, that you will develop are very important. So that's why I'm very happy to uh, welcome you all, not only to the meeting, but uh, to this project. Um, the last reason why I'm happy to work with you at Rurki, um, this morning when I was uh, telling my wife, uh, who is Indian actually, when I was telling my, my wife that uh, I'm working with Rurki, she said, ah, that's a great uh, university and um, it would be a great place to visit once uh, COVID-19 lets us travel again. And I can only take that. Um, as um, an announcement, I guess that um, as soon as we can travel again, I'll be happy to visit you in Rurki and see uh, and look at your school. But for now, um, uh, I wish you a welcome. Uh, uh, welcome, I welcome you to the to the little conference here. Unfortunately, I will have to leave you in about half an hour, but I'll be happy to listen to the following messages. Thank you for working with us. Thank you, uh, Professor Oliver Gunther, uh, for your. Uh, interesting remarks, especially when you mentioned that you would like to visit us. I think let me start by inviting you and your and your better half that you please find the earliest opportunity to visit us. Uh, that will be wonderful to seal this collaboration and take it a notch higher if, if, if both of us can meet uh, physically and also we can show you around the campus and also show you the academic departments and the facilities that exist in our campus. So um, I'm very happy to be joining this meeting and to be briefly given this opportunity to talk about my institute. So IIT Rurki, Indian Institute of Technology Rurki, owes its existence to uh, an event that happened 173 years back when the first uh, formal engineering education institution was created in the uh, British Empire, in, in fact, the entire Asia. And that happened in 1847 when the Thompson College of Civil Engineering was created. And we are the uh, reincarnation of the same institution. In fact, we, we, we continue, our names have got changed a couple of times. We became University of Rurki in 1947. And in 2001, we became IIT Rurki 
but we continue to retain the same ethos, the same spirit by which we were created. Traditionally, we have been focused very strongly on geosciences, uh, including uh, earth sciences, civil engineering, geotechnical engineering, and a natural offshoot of that, that is earthquake engineering. That is a, a separate independent department at IIT Roorkee. And uh, in fact, it is the unique department because uh, probably no other department in the country is focused only on earthquake engineering as IIT Roorkee. The second thing that makes IIT Roorkee a very uh, natural candidate for this important project related to natural hazards is that we have a very uh, dense uh, uh, activity in, in the entire sector of water resources, whether it is uh, flooding, whether it is climate change, whether it is drought, whether it is river engineering, creation of dams. We, we have multiple departments in the Institute which are interested in this. And uh, so naturally, uh, the topic of natural hazards is very important to them. And because of this backdrop, in fact, 15 years back, we created a focused center, Center of Excellence in Disaster Mitigation and Management. So that, so that also brings all these experts together at one place. And of course, because the title of the project mentions uh, Himalayan region, so I guess two very important things which are offshoots of the Himalayan region are water related hazards and earthquake related hazards and of course uh, landslide and all those things uh, that come along with it so uh, while himalayans can himalayas can be used as a lab or a, or for collecting data or for understanding the signs for these prediction of these disasters or estimating the severity or the time localization of these disasters but i hope that our scientists and engineers working on this project will try to use the knowledge gained by the data acquired in himalayan region to be able to apply it to regions across the globe or at least in some other parts of the globe so that to the himalayan region uh, iit rurki um, as i said is is very much interested in this project and i saw uh, that uh, in addition to university of potsdam and iit rurki we have five more uh, institutes who have agreed to uh, partner us in this important project the german research center for geoscience is the Potsdam Institute for uh, Climate Impact Research, the National Institute of Hydrology, the Central Building Research Institute, and the Wadia Institute of Himalayan Geology. So all these uh, institutes, although they are not degree awarding institute, they are primarily focused on uh, doing research and uh, they will bring very important experience and expertise onto the table uh, by which I hope this uh, project will be able to meet the objectives for which it is getting funded. Nowadays, funding is so competitive that if you get some funding, make sure that uh, you are able to demonstrate that you have made the best use uh, of that funding. Before I conclude, I wanted to mention a couple of highlights. Uh, this is an important forum about my institute. So uh, IIT Roorkee has the uh, largest presence of international students in India. The institute with, with the, uh, in the IIT system, the centrally funded institutes, the IIT which has the maximum number of international students is Roorkee. And that is why you will see that in ranking agencies, we score very highly on, on that uh, metric. And the second thing, which is, uh, which is very heartening and which is very uh, sort of in the right direction is that our uh, citation scores per faculty are again the highest in the IIT system. So these two important parameters uh, make us very focused on on trying to do research, but also impactful research, not, not just for the sake of publication, but publication in the best places, best forums, and trying to make sure that what we publish is of interest to the peer group so that they cite it. And that is why our citations per faculty are pretty high. I hope this project, um, uh, the, the principal from our side, Professor Ankit Agarwal, and his partner from the German side will make the best use and give leadership to it. And I see that the head of the Department of, NI, of uh, Department of Hydrology is also joined. So the entire department will be backing him, will be providing support. I wish this project a great success. And I hope that University of Potsdam and IIT Rurki use this opportunity to become close partners. And I would again uh, reiterate what I started with. Professor Oliver Gunther, please come and visit us at the earliest opportunity. Thank you. Thank you.